Okay, I am looking at uh, my email on my iPad. And what I want to do for you is kind of go through and define some of the, the terms that we use. Now, I'm just looking at this particular email box because it's one that I just signed up for a few uh, things for just to check out what people are doing. And this guy right here, David Sharp, is a very good marketer. And I really like what he does. He's a good model. If you want to know what to do, join his list so you can see what he does just to, to compare. And what I did by just opening, by just viewing that email, is it sends a message back to his autoresponder that I have opened it. So his engagement rate went up. Now, um, if it takes about 40% uh, emails are open, if you, if you look at your open rates, it might be 40%, it could be 5%. It just depends on a lot of different issues. One of the key things is, are these emails getting into my inbox? You see... His are, but I do read his stuff, so I probably have a, a 50-60% engagement rate on his emails because I'm, I like what he does, and he's a quality guy. I don't buy anything from him, but I'm messing his numbers up. But let's say I'll go to another one of his emails right here. I just clicked, and that's an engagement. That's a C-P-E-L. It's cost per engaged lead. I'm going to go through the math here in a minute. I'm going to just go to another email from someone else. If Blaster Suite, I actually own the software, but they send me emails every day anyway, and they're trying to upsell me in additional programs they have. May I buy one of them? I don't know. I might. It just depends. I like their software. I use it every day. Um, their marketing's a little over over uh, the top, but uh, all in all, it's a good. Uh, it works. So I, I use it. It helps. So you can see here what's going on. So I want to go through and do some math real quick. Let's say they bought a solo ad for $0.40 cents a click, and uh, I opted into that. Let's say a 40% conversion rate means the cost for me to be on their list is a buck a lead. That's really pretty low, to be honest with you, if you're doing solo ads. Now, let's do some more math. Um, let's say that your open rate on your emails are 40%. So if you divide that by 0.4, that means to get an engaged lead off that first email, it's $2.50 for me to be on this list and opening emails. Okay. Now, let's say I click on a link. I'm going to go back to, to one of his uh, products, uh, one of his emails. And what he does, he does a big pre-sell, and there's always, you know, something down there that says, number one, recommended build, uh, recommendation in building a business, which is one of his products. If I click on that link, I go from an engage to a cost per click basis. So now he knows that I clicked on his link. So if he's smart, and he is, he's already figured I'm an opener. That's why I'm getting these emails. Oh, he clicked. I'll probably start getting different emails probably specifically about this product to try to get me to go ahead and buy it. And it's a typical, um, probably it's a sales funnel that's available. And uh, whatever it is, it is. It's probably pretty good quality because I've been studying him for a little while and, and I like his stuff. So what I just became is a CPC for him. Okay, so let's go back to our calculator. Let's say... Um, Cost two and a half dollars for me to be on his list and for me to open an email. Let's say only about forty percent of people ever click on a link. That means it's going to cost him six dollars and twenty-five cents for me to click on that. For him to make money back, he has to make at least six dollars and twenty-five cents just to break even on me. So if you take that and uh, you divide it out, you're going to find that his profitability is going to be fairly low. This is the inherent problem with buying low cost, or I mean solo ads. It's why so many people do it but never really make any money at it. Now, if you know how to take, what he's done is he's segmented me as an opener and continues to feed me his stuff. And now he'll segment me and continue to feed me specific to that product because I clicked on the link. So I became a engaged clicker. Instead of just being an engaged lead, I'm an engaged clicker. The, each step you make makes you more valuable on his list. 
Now, if I continue to open and click on things, I'll probably start buying. That's the process that you need to go through. And you'll end up spending, you know, let's say you're going to make $50 commission on a product. You might, it might cost you that full $50 just to get me to buy. So you might just break even on that. But then I'm likely to buy again and again, and that's where you're making your money. So people are looking at a fast buck off email marketing, aren't necessarily looking at the lifespan or the return on investment in the entire sales funnel. So when guys go out and they just broadcast, there's no thought or reason they just broadcast email because they want to make money fast, they're going to wear their list out and they have no way to really scale because they don't have a marketing plan to take people through a process where they can buy everly more expensive products through the segmentation process.